Hello, dear friends. Today we will talk about life cycle of nuclear power plants. And many of us sometimes scared nuclear technology and think about its nuclear power plants and something difficult uh, and dangerous. But many of us, it's maybe all of us, each morning see the famous nature reactor. This is our sun. Incredible view. And in a deep night, we saw many, many reactors uh, like our sun, a different uh, region of our galaxy. What do you think? What do this place common? Oklo, Gabon and Obninsk. It's both unusual place in our planet. It's maybe you hear in Gabon, Okla, we had first nature nuclear reactor. And we will talk about how worked this nuclear reactor, let it be later in my city, Obninsk, uh, location near uh, Moscow, about 100 kilometers. Uh, we exploitation first nuclear energy reactor made by human. If you talk about first nature reactor in Gabon, this reactor worked approximately 2 billion years ago. And this is, uh, was an incredible uh, nature reactor because uh, that nuclear reactor looks like a huge cave with uh, nature uranium. And I think uh, many of you hear about uh, 2 billion years ago enrichment uh, nature uranium was approximately 1.4 percent isotope uranium 235 and if uh, this cave was a full water uh, water work like a moderator and uh, due to moderator uh, we uh, produced uh, thermal neutrons and start uh, chain reaction water boiling evaporate and after uh, maybe 0 0.5 year ago, water disappeared and the nature reactor stopped work. And uh, one of the main uh, chain reaction uh, you may see in this slide, reaction between neutron and uh, one of the isotope uh, uranium-235. And of course, uh, in the nature we have uh, other main isotope uh, which we use in nuclear sphere it's like uh, thorium 232 uh, plutonium different isotope 239 uh, 240 241 and of course uranium 238 and we will talk about uh, these different isotopes uh, let it be later and uh, this uh, slide uh, you may see main chain reaction between the neutron and isotope uranium-235. And due to this chain reaction, we produce uh, two particles uh, uh, from uh, two until two, three fast neutrons and a huge number of the energy, approximately 200 mega electron volt. And, uh, of course, if we want to use uranium and the nuclear power plants inside the core, uh, we should manufacture in fuel pellets. And this picture, uh, you see dioxide of uranium uh, enrichment uh, like rules uh, from 3% until to 5% by isotope uranium-235. And if we have a fresh pellets with the dioxide of uranium, uh, we may uh, work uh, these pellets by hand. It's absolutely 
safe and uh, not needed to special advice protect uh, our body from uh, fresh uh, fuel pellets and uh, these fuel pellets uh, collect uh, fuel roads and each uh, fuel roads check for different uh, maybe cracks uh, maybe let it be change the shape and other the next step, uh, these fuel pellets uh, inside the fuel elements, uh, we load in a nuclear reactor. And uh, uh, maybe you hear on the first uh, in the world nuclear power plants uh, start work in uh, Obninsk. It uh, was a 1954 years and uh, it was a not so huge power it's only five megawatt electrical power and next step uh, we produce uh, fuel assemblers and the fuel assemblers include uh, approximately 312 uh, fuel elements and uh, fuel assemblers uh, needed for us for load and reload uh, fuel elements inside and outside the core and uh, fix and uh, one of the position because if you talk about the VVR technology and the highest of the core approximately uh, 3.5 meters and uh, so highest of course and uh, fuel assemblers give for us opportunity fix and not change the shape of the fuel assemblers and this picture and this slide you may see how it looks like hexagonal fuel assemblers for the reactor of type VVR 440, 1000, 1200 and inside core we exploitation uh, we use 163 fuel assemblers enrichment or until to five percent as a top uranium 235 and approximately 121 control roads control roads uh, needed for us for a stop and start chain reaction it's so important uh, if we talk about uh, the protection nuclear power plants for a possibility increase and spread chain reaction and uh, this slide uh, include, and uh, you may see how it looks like our famous project VVR 1000 and VVR 1200. And uh, you may see core inside the core fuel assemblers, and uh, you may see inlet and outlet pipes. And uh, inlet pipes, like in white light water in uh, nuclear reactors and the increase the temperature approximately from 200 to 85 until to 320 degrees celsius and after that uh, water goes uh, through outlet pipe and uh, go to a steam generator and steam generator this is a huge construction about 12 meters in the length and uh, 6 meters in the highest and include more than 6,000 tubes. Inside these tubes uh, we use uh, coolant, light water from reactors and outside the tubes we use and uh, feed water and the feed water producing steam and after that steam goes to turbine and uh, full surfaces these tubes um, equal approximately 10 football fields it's uh, incredible size and Nuclear power plants, uh, we uh, have and we exploitation a huge number of the different equipments. And this slide, uh, you may see in the main equipments and the first socket, like a reactor reversal, four steam generators, main circulation pumps, uh, uh, emergency co cooling system, and others. And uh, of course, uh, we have a um, other building, this is a tube building. 
with uh, huge equipment uh, support exploitation turbine and uh, after turbine we have a, a generator of generator producing electricity and the electricity go to different uh, region uh, countries and cities and uh, huge factories and other other purposes and uh, full equipment uh, location and uh, reactor building and the uh, tube building and uh, we had a other building uh, support exploitation uh, or main equipment and uh, building for example include new fresh uh, fuel assemblers and uh, the building with uh, diesel generators and others and maybe many of you hear about and uh, now day we exploitation uh, generation the three plus nuclear reactor and rush federation was a first country in the world to start exploitation first uh, uh, nuclear reactor vvr 1200 uh, uh, generation the three plus it's uh, happened it 216 year and uh, now they uh, we construction exploitation more nuclear reactor generation three plus and rush duration and abroad many of my students ask me about uh, how we divide nuclear power plants and the nuclear reactor uh, generation uh, one two three and the next generation four and uh, this slide you may see like a historical information uh, how we design redesign and uh, increase our knowledge due to different project and uh, how i said in the previous five minutes uh, History peaceful nuclear technology start uh, from first uh, nuclear power plants in the world in Obninsk in 1954. And uh, until our day, uh, we construction so huge number of the nuclear reactors and the nuclear power plants. And the first uh, nuclear reactors from first nuclear power plants until to uh, first huge accident in Three Mile Island in the USA. 1979. Many specialists said about uh, this is uh, uh, was a generation one nuclear reactors, and after the Three Mile Island accident in the 1979, our world increased knowledge uh, dealt with in the nuclear power plants and uh, increase uh, safety systems. And after that, in the 1986, uh, we had an uh, accident in the unit number for Chernobyl uh, nuclear power plants. And uh, many of the specialists uh, said about uh, nuclear reactor, which we construction and uh, start exploitation b between two that accidents. So this is a uh, generation two. And after uh, Chernobyl nuclear power plants accident, uh, we of course made next step and increased safety parameters, increase our knowledge in the nuclear sphere, increase support education process for increased knowledge staff who operation nuclear power plants, who design redesign uh, nuclear power plants. And uh, until to 2011, we start exploitation of a generation uh, three nuclear power plants. And uh, maybe you heard, of course, and unfortunately, uh, 2012, uh, we had a huge accident in the Fukushima Daiichi, Japan. And after that, we let it be more increase so reliability parameters, increase number of the diesel generator accumulators and others. And uh, now dates uh, looks like step number four, and uh, we start exploitation the generation three plus technology. And step by step, we go to our near future generation for our nuclear power plants. And now, day and uh, important moment, we 
work hard and uh, a close fuel cycle. It's incredible, but two months ago, it's uh, 2022 years and August. The Russian Federation and the first country in the world uh, who closed fuel cycle. And you know, in the nowadays Russian Federation, uh, only one country in the world uh, which exploitation uh, faster nuclear operation uh, reactors, uh, energy reactors. So BN600 and BN800 with uh, sodium and uh, now they we load in the full core with uh, mixed oxygen fuel with uh, pluton dioxide of plutonium, dioxide of uh, uranium, and uh, nowadays our rush federation closed the fuel cycle. And uh, this is so important because if we and all the world uh, exploitation uh, nuclear reactor only use and the dioxide of uranium, the main um, isotope uh, uranium-235, this fuel uh, will be enough and we'll have uh, this fuel only next uh, 50 or 60 years. It's a short period of time. And after the close fuel cycle, uh, we increase uh, this time until to uh, 200 years, 300 years, and involve all uh, type of the um, isotopes and uh, involve and waste of uh, nuclear technology inside the process produce and energy. And next uh, step for all uh, the nuclear technology, it's like a uh, final steps. So this is a decommissioning of nuclear power plants. And of course, the decommissioning have a different studies and we remove the fuels, remove the main huge equipment and remove waste, low radioactive, high radioactive waste. And like a final view all uh, these uh, the decommission in the process it's uh, a green field uh, what is mean green field uh, this is a uh, territory looks like uh, absolutely without building uh, green growth trees and others and uh, one of the other idea it's maybe not uh, like a green area it's uh, like a gray area with a small building and uh, small equipments which uh, check uh, different parameters and uh, this territory and uh, due to my lectures today we will talk about all cycle of uh, nuclear technology start uh, from uh, manufacturing, producing the fuel, and uh, we talked about how we use this fuel inside the nuclear reactors, and of course, in the like last step, all uh, exploitation for all nuclear reactors. So this is decommissioning nuclear reactors. Thank you very much. Uh, Dear friends, dear colleagues, and this slide you may see information about myself, and if needed, uh, you may contact me. Thank you very much. Goodbye.